vacuum cleaner. You don't want the air to float around. It will poke you in the eye. Over. Yes, we have emergency pods. In fact, the spacecraft we use to come to space station, it stays parked here. So that is our escape vehicle. I flew here on the Soyuz, and it's a Soyuz spacecraft from Russia, and it's still parked. It will be here all the time it will be here, and if there's an emergency, I will use that same spacecraft to leave space station. Over. Uh, very interesting physics question. So this is a concept that uh, Albert Einstein uh, thought about. He realized that the uh, gravity is made by the, the presence of matter and the same thing with time. So time and space are the same and gravity can distort them uh, a bit like it stretches time and it stretches space as well. And that's how objects fall to each other. So in the beginning it was just a mathematical curiosity, but now we can see it, we can measure it. We can see it when we measure, for example, uh, very precise clocks that are on satellites because when we're on satellites or here in space station, time goes a little bit slower. So it's just very, very small difference. Just because gravity is a bit different. Over. Yes, we're in the time zone of uh, London, England, in uh, universal time. So right now here in space station, it's uh, 7.50 in the evening. Over. Maybe on the moon, maybe on Mars, uh, but you know, the Earth is by far the best planet for humans. So I think the most important is that we protect planet Earth, make sure that planet Earth remains a good place to live uh, for our children and our grandchildren and our great-grandchildren to come. That is the safest thing for us to do, is keep planet Earth our home. Over. on the rocket. There was like vibration, acceleration. I was squished in my seat. I could feel all the, uh, the strength of the engine. It lasted only about eight minutes and then the engine stopped and I was floating in space and I could see the beautiful sunrise on the curve of the earth outside the window. It was a whole new world for me. It was very, very uh, touching. It was very beautiful. Over. strange thing here, I think the feeling of flying all the time and then looking out the window and seeing the earth and seeing how, it's not strange but it's just, uh, it's impressive every time I see the earth, how the sky is black and the earth is glowing blue. It's not just blue, it's glowing like, like it's a, a light. So that's what's amazing, how beautiful the earth is and this beautiful blue glow. Over. silent, but inside the space station, it's quite noisy because there's machines, computers, air, air conditioning systems, there's always some noise in the background. Over. I miss my family, my wife, my children, the people I love most, my parents, my friends. I miss human beings, the people who made me. Uh, that's what I miss most. I wish they could visit me up on Space Station. Over. Well, you know, Knight, I don't know if you can still hear me, but uh, I wish you a uh, happy uh, spring and summer, and uh, you live in a beautiful town. Bye-bye.